Hey guys, it's Lexium here, and today I'll be showing you how to use the plug-in locket that uh, allows you to lock chests and doors. So first you want to do is go to this link that I'll have in the description and download the jar and put it in the plugins folder. I already have it downloaded in here. Uh, so right, I'll go to the config for, for you guys. Basically, you really don't need to change anything. If you want, like when you open a door that's locked, which I'll show you how to do in a second, it'll automatically close after one second, because I have one. But everything else, you don't really need to change unless you want to change this. The admin bypass allows them to bypass like other player locks. Um, nothing. Oh yeah, explosion protection. Like they won't blow up if a creeper blows up, but yeah. It's all good. And then um, here I'll go to the permissions. Oh yeah, uh, it's a it's only confirm uh, compatible with these two uh, permissions plugins. That's the only ones. I use Group Manager. Uh, where is it? Down here, right here. This you'll want to have for every single um, group. So just put it on the lowest group for the default, or no, yeah, default group. Where is it? Builder. This will probably be where you put it. I have other tutorials on how to use group manager, but lock it. Dot user, dot create, dot that, the star. Oops. And that'll give them the permission to require to create a protected container or door. Uh, yeah, you can lock furnaces, you can lock a bunch of stuff. But uh, yeah, just save that. I'm already the owner, so I'll already be able to do that. But So now I'll show you guys how to do it in the server, how to lock up stuff. Open up Minecraft. And uh, here's a little shack I made if you want to lock. So if you say you want to like lock a door. Um, you can either put it on the front or the back, doesn't matter. But uh, just do a bracket and then private. And then it'll automatically fill in your name. And if you want other people to be able to access it, leave the second line blank for your name to be automatically filled in. And then it'll just, now it'll let Chua also in. He's pretty cool. I like him. And then, um, if you want to lock a chest, same thing. But you can just right click it and it'll automatically do that. And the same goes for if you want to add like other people to be able to use it. Second line blank, schwa, white. And then I'll let him also into the chest. And then that's the same for crafting to. Oh, sorry. Wait. Actually, no, I don't think you can do this. Yeah, no, you can't. But you can do it with furnaces, pretty sure. Yeah. Because you're actually putting, like, valuable stuff in there. But, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I'll have some new videos out soon. And, yeah, I'll have some more tutorials. I might be adding some actual, like, Minecraft stuff soon. But I'm not sure yet, because I need to finish the, the server building and stuff. We have couple of cities we're building right now for each of the guys who joined in they're going to be my server admins so yeah i'll see you guys later thanks bye